Yigit, but what exactly are you doing here? Just tell me the truth so I know what I'm getting myself into. Look, we're doing business coordination here. Transportation, delivery, reconciliation, things like cash proceeds. Just Ender, Salim, and you? I have 20 more guys on it. Everyone except Nahat's men work directly under me. So what's Nahat then? Is he a partner or a boss? We don't have a right to his profit, so he gets 60% of our profits. So it's hash money. Commission. Yeah, commission my foot. All right, so then what do I need to do? Anytime that I'm not available to be here, you will be here to represent me. I don't want Ender or Salim to do it because they're already running a lot of businesses. Plus, I need someone capable of being level-headed when solving a crisis. That person is you, dear. Okay? Okay. Go, go. Welcome, Mr. Nahat, sir. Before everyone else gets here, I thought that maybe we could have a word. Of course. Daria is my assistant. She will coordinate the business and represent me when I'm not available. Nice to meet you. A pleasure. Coffee. Go on. Um, let me get you some coffee. How would you like it? So, you're having your representative serve your visitors coffee as well, huh? That's right. I'll serve you 60% of the coffee so you'll feel comfortable, okay? Ah. Since you like that number. Two regular coffees will be fine, Daria. <laughs> Daria doesn't pull any punches, although she knows when to hold her tongue. I like it. She would probably make a good hitman. <laughs> <laughs> probably. So, how's your brother doing? Is he still adamant about his decision? I feel bad that he lost his job because of us. Well, sir, Amir is the most stubborn guy that you could ever meet. He's more concerned with his beliefs rather than making sure that he doesn't starve. I'm afraid that he'll decide to become a politician or something like that someday. Oh, he would win all the votes with his handsomeness. <laughs> but if he gets into office, we'll be the first ones on his list. <laughs> mm hmm <clears throat> Anyway. In that case, my final wish would be to drink a coffee served by you. Oh, I'd be a prisoner too. I don't think that they'd let me out just to make coffee. <laughs> you have to think of something else. But don't worry, if I don't get locked up with you, I'll kindly make you a final coffee. You think I'm being a little tactless. <laughs> I guess so. You get, gave me this job as a crisis manager, and yet I seem to be creating a crisis instead. Thank you, Daria. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.